Hello, I'm Ederson Oliveira. I'll be presenting this video for dnnhero.com. In this video, I'll be talking about how you can verify uh, in Google Webmaster Tools that you are the true site owner of the website that you want to use Webmaster Tools for. So we are here in a, with a, a, a sample, a test website, a test.net website. This is a DNN561. And if we log into the back end, and I'm going to log in as super user. If we go under admin search engine sitemap, under this uh, page, we should be able to verify via this verification option. This is one way to verify that you are the owner of the website. Uh, now, I have tried to use this feature and it didn't really work well, but let's let's try to find how we can do that within .NET Nook. Um, so, I'm going to the Webmaster Tools. This URL I'm going to post in the video post. You're going to see that there. And I do already have a, a, G, uh, a Google account. So, I'm going to log in as uh, my user. So, I have just logged in. I have two sites there, but as you can see, this particular site, here's the domain, is not there yet. And we're going to try to validate the site and, and make sure that uh, we that we have set up under Google that we are the owner of the site. So how can we do that? So from here, from Webmaster Tools, I'm going to add a new site. And this is my URL. Again, this is a, just a development site. As you can see, it's a subdomain. You can click on continue. And by doing so, now I have to verify that I'm the owner. And there are a couple of different options here. Uh, DNS record, we're gonna, not going to go there. Uh, this option here that says upload an HTML file to your server. Well, this should be the option that this verification would work with, work together. But as you can see, I'm going to... Again, might be a bug or even something that I'm doing wrong, but I don't think it is. But if I copy this file, I should be able to copy the name of the file and paste it here as a verification. And then if I click create, see, the, the page just refreshed. I should be able to click verify and it should verify correctly, but it's not verifying. So Again, uh, maybe a little bug that will be fixed in the next version of .NET Look. But the option that we're going to try here is the add meta tag to your site's homepage. This is the option that we're going to use to verify that we are the true owner of this website. I'm going to click here. And here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to copy this tag that was displayed here, as it says, copy this tag. And I'm going to go back to my site. I'm going to forget this option for a sec. Search engine sitemap. I'm going to forget about that. I'm going to go to the home page. And in the home page, I'm going to go to edit this page. I will scroll down and I go to advanced settings. Under advanced settings, there is an option that says page header tags. I'm going to paste that tag that I have just copied from Google Webmaster. I'm going to paste it here. I'm going to save this. I'm going to click update. Now the home page has that tag. And if I go back and I click verify, it should work. So it did work. It, it worked so well that it already brought me to the dashboard of my site. If I go back to the main page of uh, Google Webmaster Tool, as you can see, my new site is here. And this is the site. So this is it. This is how you can verify uh, with uh, Google Webmaster Tools that you are the true owner of your .NET website. Thank you very much and bye for now.